No, he absolutely does. That's what yeah, I'm saying. The... <laughs> yeah, your point is correct. My bad. Ready, what are you guys drinking? Me? Oh, H2, bro. Oh. Yeah, I'm drinking canned water. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, did you see the fucking Jar Jar Binks coffee pasta before? Yeah, I posted it today. It's so good. Yeah. Me so <laughs> wave dash. <laughs> 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 We got Alice's uh, fox here again. Yeah, Black. I can see oh, the game's up. Yep, game's up. Alice's fox is pretty randy. Oh, yeah, shine him. Shine him. Oh, in that situation, you really have to wiggle out of hit stun. Because if you jump, you just don't have time to get a punish. I am actually so here for the fox cheese. Ooh! <laughs> Fuck, I'm doing it again! <laughs> doing what, man? Watching the stream. <laughs> Yeah. I, I don't know why you like turn the stream back on. Look, like you actually have to go out of your way to, to go into the tab. Camera. To... What, do, what do you mean, man? Because my camera it doesn't matter. It's oh no, I get you. I get you. I'm picking Big up. Big bear. Up is sexy. Bear. Yeah. Nice. Like finding some uh, pretty crucial combo extensions. What? Oh. That's scary. Mm. Just having a quick snooze on the ledge there. You know, That's I'm really the thing about Battlefield. Well. You always get the good enough where they just hit you and get Battlefielded. I'm actually genuinely impressed by Lack's change of kind of tempo overall. I was saying the other day, and like the last couple of times I've played him and seen him play, he plays far more defensive, but Lax is actually earning the um, aggressive like kind of gameplay. The game, yeah, no, he's definitely trying to change how he plays, which is really, really good to see. Yeah, absolutely. And like taking taking it on board. A lot of people are like, yeah, 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 yeah. Watch what you call it. Oh, like, amazing shine. Dude, that was this combo so too. Oh, 60 is still Wait, huge. That's oh, great game sense to know that you are going to get enough shield push off with the light shield to get that yeah. shine. Lax kind of dominating this game, but it's still really close. All it takes is like one shine knockdown. Yeah, that's fucked up in a nutshell, I think. Like, yeah. Falco really does seem like he's in control a lot of the time. Yeah, but sometimes Falco's just getting like running shine knockdown, like just getting bullied really hard. But, like it feels like Lax is just hard controlling this. From just about every angle. Really solid movement there from Alice though. Oh that could have been a shine there. Kinda got a weird Roy zone on that laser too. Mm. Love the little wavelength of Flatty. Oh, guess the dash he just Dude. before they hit the floor. Fled. Good raid, just bad execution there. Oh, this is savage. Nice grab, I like that. Keep it simple. Crazy <gasps> dashy, that's a shine. Or a bear. Dude, you. Go fuck it? Yes. Alright, this is so doable. Freaking out about the recovery there. You, you have no idea, man. You get hit by the laser, you get put slightly under oh, the Oh, the pressure! Base. So yeah. different from oh, Akira. The that was the some fucking jabs. horrendous DI. How, what are you supposed to do? There's just so many kicks hitting your shield so fast. Roll. Just roll. No, I don't know. But what if you can hit him? That's what goes through every player's mind when you're getting rapid jabs. Like, this is bad. How do I beat this? That's why you're just going to hit the level of Zen of where you don't think. And you just let your <laughs> fucking game sense take control. You can let go of shield, hold down, maybe SDI like down in the way, and then down tilt, I'm pretty sure. What a complicated answer for such a shit option. <laughs> yeah, I mean... That's the essay, Nick. But I mean, the but the option doesn't work, right? If you do the right option. It's true. Maybe for you, man. Yeah, maybe. For Lax? Wins the, wins the game off it. Yeah, yeah I, I think rolling there is just the right call. Like, just disengage and then start again. Real, realistically. Ready, go. Oh, oh switch. my goodness, man. I'm here for it. This is the Geordie Slayer. And I'd say... Whoa. That's I mean it's nearly just fucking doomsday. I'd say in a nutshell, Lax is not as good as Microsoft J and Microsoft J has lost to this Jiggle Puff. Ooh, that's exciting. I actually heard about this Jiggle Puff yesterday, I think, for the first time. I was talking to Alice. She yeah, this is the one that put it, Geordie into the steel <gasps> toilet. <laughs> I hate the toilet. <laughs> Ooh, what a nair grab. You have something nice one. Another one? Oh, why back? Oh, oh. there's another back there. Yeah. Oh, that'll do it there. Also, did Lax beat Emps the other day, or did Emps beat Lax? Lax beat Emps. Ah, uh, okay. It's pretty impressive. I wonder if Lax actually plays against any parts. Because I know Maka used to play in Queensland, but I don't know if it's... I guess it doesn't matter online anymore, but... There's not that many parts around. 
Yeah, or spot dodge detail. I'm really liking what I'm seeing from this buff, by the way. Uh oh. It's nothing questionable, you know? Sometimes I watch a puff and I'm like, ugh. Why? But this is just like really good spacing around the lasers. <laughs> just a good sense for how to hit something. Yeah, I Bro, fully agree in between the I two. I just want you to know, Gorilla Lamp just changed colors. <laughs> Coincidence? <laughs> I love these up airs from Alice too. The shocking so good. It's so hard to contest Falco with Puffs up air. Because Falco's down air will lose the Puffs up air. But um, only for like two frames, and the down air's out for like a second. Yeah. This is so much more even than I thought it would be. Like, just because, like, I don't know how much Alice actually plays these. Oh, that was a rest. You reckon? Yeah, absolutely. That was a rest. That's a hard. Like, you, you have to be good at this space. Inshallah, she goes to bed there. Oh! Holds down. Okay, Sorry, okay. Big fan oh. of Alice having like a varied approach to getting around lasers. Like often she's doing like a wave dash through the laser, like forwards. Yeah, a lot of a lot of the time puffs will just like try and float over and uh it's pretty like easy for Falco to set up around. You know what's super refreshing? Like, like I am an M's fan and all, but seeing a puff not approach with Nair is so <laughs> nice. Yeah, Emp yeah, uh, definitely well, knows the elephant in the room. Before. Very different from how Emp's plays. Huge, sure. yeah, huge. Yeah. With Emp's being like one of the only puffs left, it's but also just the fact that Alice, Alice is actually looking like a high level player with this puff, and I haven't mm. seen it in a very long time. I like it. Like, yeah, no, I like it a lot. That's a rest. What? Nice. I knew she was gonna go for it too when she got the up throw. I was like, this is the tech in situation. I mean, look, let's be real, Nick. You're a pretty cognizant puff player. <laughs> <laughs> I'll never deny that. Oh, thanks, Caleb. But yeah, good, good, good recognition that like you can just win the game here, you know. Um, yeah, hundred percent. Finish it off, and you know, like people hate taking in place against Puff because that's like the most common, you know, tech read people go for, and you don't want to fall for the like tech trap bullshit with the up air. So you just try to get to the side of the platform, maybe get some SDI off. So this is one one. Yeah, because it's Fox game. It almost feels like a fresh set off. Like, it just feels like a different player. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Black is just right back to the old camp arena. I don't think it's necessarily a bad thing. Oh. <laughs> Do you reckon if, if Falco is actually going to try and hold space against Puff, do you think holding it vertically is better than horizontally? Because uh, Black is using Puff flat a lot more than like side flats and like AC bears and lasers and whatnot. Well, kind of stems into what Nick was saying, right? Where like. It is really, really hard to shock, like, uh, Falco stare with only, like, those two frames of up air beating down air. Yeah, I, oh I think my from God. a puff player perspective, what I hate is when the Falco is on, ground, on the ground level and they're controlling me with lasers. Like, You're just not I able think, to get sky high. I always feel like I can do, like, the perfect up air to shock Falco, you know? But if they're playing, like, the grounded neutral with lasers, I'm like, oh, I'm just stuck. Dude, up air is so deceptive to me. Like, it just looks so small, but like when they wave, like the wave, like they weave the wave in. I can't believe that. Was that the that. second hit that killed? That actually might have been the first hit up air that killed. I could be wrong. But it didn't work. I thought it was a second shine. Oh, yeah. Was it a shine? Am I crazy? Yeah, it was shine. Well, I am crazy. Yeah, Shoot the best of us. Ah. Oh, Alice kind of fishing here. This stage is so hard. Yeah, 100%. I mean, playing vertical on this stage seems to be really, really good. You just get like the time to drop through and stuff like that isn't that much. Oh. It's actually so hard to contest Falco's side B with Puff. Yeah, oh yeah. One trick, like rule of thumb as a as a Puff player is uh, when I'm facing towards the Falco off stage, uh, they should up B. And when I'm facing away from them, it's like impossible to react with back air. Because forward air will like lose or trade with Falco's up B. Yeah, yeah. Well, what area would you like recommend using the counter so, like Falco's side B? Because like back air feels like you have to time it precisely, which is pretty hard. Yep. Forward air is yeah, usually right? better. You can hang it yeah. out there. Because uh, Alice seems to be going for Nairs. Which Nairs is also really good. It's like pretty, pretty reactive. Like you can fade into it a little bit, but it's not as big, right? It's a really high priority move though, it's got a bit of disjoint, it stays out for a while, hits at a nice angle. You can also kind of like hit really low and stay on stage with Nair. Okay. Ooh, oh, 
Oh, maybe oh. I. Oh. You're gonna be thinking here, what would Juan do? Yeah, this is clutchable. Juan Can you think think against Armada? Yeah, no. Juan would be all the way out of his chair at Jersey Mike's right now. <laughs> oh, this is scary to not shield there. <laughs> Alright, I, I, like... I need to see I need to see back through cheese and rub the rest. I need that. I love um, oh. when Buff gets like pushed back with like an, like scraping against the floor and is actionable. He's just like fighting the force with like pounds. It's just like going against the current. Uh, yeah. That's gonna kill. Right. Oh! oh! Alice I not get, quite excited. ready enough to cheese. Uh, Lax a couple of times doing like jabs or like unsafe moves on Puff's shield. Is that a shield grabbable? And often when you're stuck in the vortex, it's a bit scary to go for, but I think you have to know, like, I am two stocks to one down at, like, a million percent. I need a cheesy grab here. I'm just looking out for a jab or something. For real. Where do you reckon we go? I, I want to like Alice. Is, I do too, but I don't feel like Alice is a dreamland path. As dumb as that sounds. I think everyone's a dreamland path. Not an FD moth. The, like, living for so long is just no, a buff. I, I feel like this is going to be an FD falcon. <laughs> No, mm. Pokemon Stadium? El Stadio de Pokemon? <laughs> Why'd you have a list? El Stadio. <laughs> Why'd you, you have a list? They say... That's Spanish people talk, Josh. Fucking you know. <laughs> hell. Oh my, that Australian shield was insane. Yeah, really threaded the needle in the uh, shield pressure. <laughs> the Garfield. Shout out to Garfield, the new up and coming park man in Australia. Prefers the counterpick to Pokemon Stadium. Maybe yours taking the inspiration. Mm. I, for one, would not be surprised. This really is a dog stage in this matchup, though, right? Like, as far as the options go. I think Alice just didn't want to deal with top platform. She didn't want to play the, like, shocking game. Yep. Yep. No, that makes perfect sense. Still, why, would, why, why wouldn't you go. Uh, I guess that piece probably worse, eh? Hey? I'm really curious to see how well Alice is able to hold on to this stock! Um, wow, uh, great job there. Commentator's freaking curse. <laughs> God, oh, damn, man, my bad. Just light shield on the platform, right? Like, nothing bad can happen to you if you just light shield on the platform. Yeah, absolutely, invincibility. The pretty scary shield pressure from uh, from Lax. Um, this is, these are the moments when, as Puff, you feel like, damn, I just really can't do any option, huh? Because like you've just gotten stuck in this little vortex of down airs. Yeah, fished yeah. way too hard there. There's no way. No way. What? <laughs> <laughs> Double dip, maybe. What if? Alice is doing the uh, the two saint wave dashes, which I like. The grinder one. Wave dash in. Yeah. Yep. Well, obviously the grinder, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Like very short. Yeah, they can't calling people on Milky Way looking ass in chat. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look, I just Ooh, call like I see it, man. Alice has been on top of getting crossed up with these up smashes out of shield. Yeah, but crucial that Lax is always taking the up smashes. Because they can be awkward to tech, and if you tech away, you are just free, usually. That's Falco. Ooh, that dare was a really oh, good idea. No punish off the jab. Confirms it, but just runs away. Surprise. One thing I was always told about this matchup is, like for both spaces, is having like outside of laser and stuff like that, having your back to buff is just so good from control. Like the disjoint of back air and up tilt. Oh. The oh, oh, that's that's so hard because you know it's like a net play compensating for the side B by just doing something preemptive. Oh, these aerials are not safe, but... Black's doing just good enough of a job to, um, get oh, Alice yeah. away from shield grabbing. This is yeah. a big edge guard. Oh, somehow it's not. Up for like, a rest. Yeah, up bailed out rest. by, uh, Puff tournament winner there. I, I need oh. this. I could have been it. You saw what I saw right there. <gasps> oh, I did. Oh my! That's it? Living? If Alice waved, like, waved dash didn't go that. Oh, oh Jiggly? My. Oh! <laughs> this is a ledge dash, isn't Letting it? Letting a ledge use Jigglypuff feels so bad. GG. Puff has a really good ledge, but, uh. Crazy match.
well, well played from Lex. Good showing from Alice. Uh, yeah, that was a really, really solid show from Alice. Unfortunate couple of mistakes here and there, but look, music makes people lose control. We, what's going on, man? What, you need waiting for you to pull your cami up. But uh, good. yeah. <laughs> music does make you lose control. Is this good, man? So we're what? back to working. Can someone refresh my memory? Was Goody Goody last in Winner's Side 3 1 or was it 3 2? It I was 3 1. Yeah. I'd love to see Goody ult the first set. Hey, look at him. I know oh. I I know Goody has a Marth. I know Goody has a Falco. I've actually seen the Goody Falco beat other good players, such as Melodic. The Goody Falco is good. I like it a lot. It's actually not bad. It kind of reminds me of the SA Nick Falco, to be honest. Hey. I got a lot of respect for um, SA Nick Falco. He's been he's been hide in hiding for the last like five years. But yeah, no, I he, definitely he saw it relatively now. recently. Didn't you play Miles with it in a tournament recently? Nah. I played Online? I played like one game against Falk. There you go. Not Miles. 